always tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. Still slowly clearing out of the rain. We have lingering mist across West Michigan, and the clouds are going to be slow to clear tonight. Live look outside. Plan on some scattered showers and areas of mist if you're headed out. Temperatures have dropped into the 40s across the board, so looking quite gray across the board in West Michigan. Tomorrow, we are expecting to see a return of the sunshine, and skies are going to start to try to clear out tonight, but it's going to be a struggle. It's going to take a while, and areas of mist are expected through at least midnight with some areas of fog potentially forming tomorrow morning. From there, we'll head up to 51 degrees for Wednesday. This is warmer than average for this time of year. Average highs are in the upper 30s right about now, so once again, we're just exceeding it by a long shot. For Thursday, 53 degrees, mostly sunny skies. Each day, we'll have some cloud cover from time to time, but it's not going to be uh, nearly as gray as what we experienced today. Here's the system that brought us downpours last night. Many spots along the lakeshore picked up around an inch of rain, and then areas closer to 131 picked up about a half an inch of rain, so a good solid soaking. You can see the clearing line here stretching back through Wisconsin, and you can also see a low cloud deck that's being revealed over central Illinois. This is over West Michigan as well. You can see how the high, bright white clouds are scooting out revealing some of the low cloud deck that's still lingering. So we got two different cloud decks that need to dissipate before it can get back to sunshine here. High pressure is going to pass overhead. It's going to help to drag down some drier air for us tonight, so that will help. By 7 a.m., we're likely going to be dealing with mostly cloudy skies, gradually giving way to some sunshine. So by the time we get to the end of the day on Wednesday, it'll feel like a blue sky day with temperatures rebounding to about 51. We hold on to a lot of the sunshine for Thursday as the winds continue out of the northeast. But watch what's headed our way for Friday. Fresh wave of rain creeping closer. So Friday, we expect rain showers to move in. And again, Thursday stays dry. It's not until Friday that that system scoots in. Right now, we've got shower chances on Friday at about 60%. Some of those linger for the first half of Saturday. And then Sunday, 30% chance of showers, but some of that could actually fall as snow. Here's a look at your future cast for Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Friday morning starting dry, but it's the afternoon to evening that it really looks like this system is going to start to move in. And it will stick around through Saturday, 7 a.m. By the time we get to Saturday evening, we should start to dry out again, but the air is cold enough on the back side of that system that we'll begin to see a few flakes flying. Not many, but enough to give us just a light coating, especially in spots like South Haven or Kalamazoo. Eight day forecast reveals more sunshine than not. After we get past a few flakes on Sunday, we're back to 40s and 50s the following week with some sunshine. This really is the winter that wasn't. I mean, it just cannot take hold and it looks like we're just going continue on the warm trend here. Oh. Breeze right past Moving it. Moving past it. Okay. Ellen, thank you.